180, he doesn't have the power, but he doesn't have the accuracy and timing. If you're that aggressive, get overconfident. Oh, big left oh hand by God. Garcia. Rocks Haney early. Garcia. The biggest troll in history goes to Ryan Garcia. First, it was 6'9". Ryan Garcia just trolled the whole world to the point that we all believed he was crazy. Now, I know I made a video breakdown. I did a whole breakdown. This looks really crazy on me right now. But this looks crazy on you, too, because you didn't think Ryan Garcia was about to win this. Let's be honest, bro. Ryan Garcia, the type of stuff he was doing, bro, he, bro, he made son look like a fire. Rookie. I'm on fire. I'll break this whole thing right now. That's how I'm firing. I'm strong. I'm strong. I'm strong. I'm strong. I'm strong. <laughs> and comes out and does this. Hold on. Copyright. 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 Damn. Oh my. Bro was on his knees. Bro, this is the champ. Bro, I'm not going to lie, bro. I did not expect any of this. I got to be honest. I didn't I did not expect this. If anything, I thought it was going to go to 12 rounds and um Haney was going to win by points or maybe even Haney even knock him out. I've always been a Garcia fan, but the way he's been acting, he's been like on some other stuff. So I did not believe that he was going to win this fight at all. I'll just come out and say that. But when Garcia's in his back, it is fun to watch. He's going for that left. And I promise you, I'm, I'm the whole time I'm thinking like, did they not? Hold on. That's my bad. That's my bad, y'all. My camera had died. But, yo, listen. Nobody expected this. But when I say that was a fun fight, I had one to the bar last night with my bros. And we was watching it. And, like, I was hype. I'm never going to lie. Because, I mean, I feel like a small piece in all of us kind of believed it was possible. But it literally took a needle in a haystack moment for that to happen. And we all just watched it. Like, that was a good fight and it went all 12 rounds and I think I don't know about y'all but at all times I felt like it could have went any way like the fight could have went any way like Haney looked like he was sizing him up at one point it was hugging a little too much but Haney looked like I uh, he had something in the tuck that at any moment he was about to pull it out and just y'all you know I mean just molly wop son but Every time Ryan hit him with a combo, it was like Haney was just flustered and just he couldn't find out where the shots was coming from. And I ain't going to lie, Ryan still did exactly what we said he was going to do. He was he was throwing punches, but at the same time, he would drop his hands every time he throw punches. It's just Haney wasn't countering nothing. He wasn't countering nothing. Ryan has to improve his defense, though. His defense was making me so mad. Every time he he tried to do the the roll the roll with the shoulder, he would like curl up and like Haney just start now I mean just violating his sides. But it's like Ryan wasn't even phased by that. It was like you threw a rock at an elephant, bro. That was a crazy fight to see, bro. I ain't gonna lie. 
He shocked the world. He ain't just shocked me. He shocked Pian the world. Devin Haney lost to Ryan Garcia by majority decision. And they say that Ryan Garcia broke his jaw, bro. Devin Haney, a controlled, patient, nearly flawless fighter, taking on Ryan Garcia. Following months, weeks, and days of... Bro, his flaw is he does not hit hard enough. If it was going by points and Ryan Garcia did not attack him, because it was rounds that Ryan did not attack him, that I was like, Ryan, come on. Like, that's that's how you're going to win. You're going to win by knocking him down. You can't be on your back foot. Every time Ryan go forward, Haney look flustered. And he surprised me. His footwork didn't look that bad either yesterday. Ryan Garcia footwork didn't look that bad. But still with the defense, it was bad. Like, like his defense is horrible to me. Like, all that standing still and curling up and turning your back, that looked crazy. But when Sun would go forward and throw them hands, it was like it was coming so fast, pause, no diddy. You know what I mean? That he just didn't know what to do. Devin just did not know what, what has to been do, one bro. of the and the crazy thing is the shit talking that Bill Haney be doing, which is Devin Haney's dad. It's like, yo, I want to hear his response. <laughs> the shit talking Devin Haney has done, I want to hear it like, like, nah, like, I know he said, oh, I ain't breaking, my jaw's not broken or whatever, whatever. But, bro, you got knocked down about five, six times. The referee saved you. Let's talk about the ref real quick, bro. At what point in time do you think it's time to, to kill the fight? Am I the only one that felt like, okay, like, you got to end it. Like, son is hurt. See, this is the thing about boxing, and people don't realize it. The referee is there to avoid the boxers from getting too hurt. So, although people get knocked out, the referee's not supposed to wait until you get knocked out, which is why you see a lot of fights get get cut off short. You know what I mean? Because the ref sees something like, nah, this person's about to get hurt. The ref let that go on for way too long. You watch a dude get dropped five or six times. I think they only counted three. But he's getting beat up bad. Protect him and kill the fight. He probably had money on it. Nah, I mean, like, it. everybody had money on Haney. I already know. I was even looking for where I could put money on Haney. I was about to go for the low in Garcia and go for the high in Haney. But he proved us all wrong. And shout out, shout out to Garcia, bro. That was a great fight, bro. Coming off of a loss from um, Javante, this is a great way to come back, bro. Because now you've proven to us you deserve to be in that top echelon. And if he would have just won by just the numbers, like, and it was like an upset or something like that, then it still would have been debatable if he belongs up there, if it was rigged, anything like that. But the fact that he knocked them down five or six times, and this is the champion, that tells you a whole lot about where Ryan Garcia is at. Surprise the world. Shout out to Ryan Garcia and his camp. They did their damn thing, all right? We're going to watch a little bit more of this. Um, matter of fact, I want to watch this clip right here. This is Ryan Garcia after. This is what son is doing after. He has continued the trolling. My son has Ryan Garcia after the fight was mocking point. Devin Haney and Bill Haney while smoking and also done a live Twitter space straight after. You know how we do a victory joint, baby. Smoking on that Bill Haney back. That Bill Haney back. <laughs> Yo, he is the biggest right, troll hey. ever. He couldn't stop you tonight. Flawless victory. Thank you. Yeah, Flawless. Let's go enjoy it, baby. You deserve Flawless. it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yo, yeah, now yeah, it's crazy because like before we was all like yo this nigga is crazy now it's like nah you're a fucking genius bro like like look how niggas is now they laughing before they everybody was cringing like yo what is wrong with him he's bugging out now it's like yo this dude yeah he's crazy as hell but the shit worked i was saying all fight my son haney got knocked out by a crackhead i i, I still stand on that he got knocked out by a crackhead by a dope fiend. You know what I mean? Because a lot of that stuff Ryan was saying was just off the wall, bro. Like, I still look at him like, bro, that was a crazy level of trolling. Crazy level of trolling. Yeah, 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 yeah,
Haney Pack, nigga. Haney Pack, yeah, nigga. Hack. Yeah, nigga. Yo. Yeah, Haney Pack. Yo. Yo. Yo, Bill, where you at, Bill? Yeah, Bill. You looking oh, like Bill Cosby God. tonight. Come on, man. <laughs> ah. Where we at, man? Haney Pack. We in New York, man. Where we at? Oh, yeah, what they say? Easy. What? Cali Knights. I hate from. <laughs> oh, bro, you clowning, bro. We chilling. That nigga high as hell. Yeah, that. Right after the fight, bro. And you trying to act like it's all good. No, it ain't good. Fuck them niggas. Mm -hmm. Hey, where's Mike at? Mike Tyson, come through. Tell him. Right. Yeah. Tell him come blow. We hot boxing. Yeah, that. Hey, yo. <laughs> I recorded that time. In the build up to the fight, this guy has spent hours on Twitter spaces and met a few people he considers friends and straight after <laughs> went on that Twitter space to spend some time with them as well. He had said this straight after the fight. Hey, what's up guys? I told you I would come back. Relax. That is epic. Like co-host. Go, Bro, man. What the here, fuck? Uh, I told you. I told you it'd be a lot of work. Darren, which tower are we going to? I told you guys. Remember, I told you. Remember, I told Congratulations. you guys. Congratulations. Thank you, dude. Let's yeah. fucking go, Ryan. Congrats, Ryan, you man. are a so fucking dog. Yeah, dog. Thank you, thank you bro. I'm I appreciate that. Dog, you know, uh, I just like to keep my word. You know, at the end of the day, I said I was gonna come here right after the fight. I did as soon as I can. Um, what's up? What you guys been do doing? Bro, Ryan is the biggest troll ever. And honestly, I really think like that should be Devin Haney's second L because to me he still lost the Loma fight. I still don't believe he won that fight. But unbelievable. Um I wanna see if we could get a shot of how Well, Devin believe Haney it or not, the time fight. has come and the fight is on. I haven't said the fight's on all week long because I didn't know for sure, but it's gonna happen. They're both 25 bro, years. Devin's face, this was an amazing fight. You guys are longtime rivals. Is this a fight you'd like to do again? Yeah, let's run it back. All right, Ryan, we'll turn. I don't want to watch him fight Devin again. He proved this point. Over to Devin Haney. Devin, your thoughts on what happened tonight? Bro, listen. That's like watching Ter Terrence Crawford fight Errol Spence again. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see that. I want to see you fight the next big dog. I, don't don't fight this man again. But look at this man's face. This is the champ. Just be lucky if son ain't make weight. <clears throat> be lucky that Ryan didn't make weight. He could have took all your belts. And he only missed weight by like three pounds. So don't try to say, oh, yeah, it's the extra three pounds. And because he didn't make weight, that's why he had an advantage, bro. It's three pounds. Come on, my nigga. Like, he just didn't give a damn enough to make weight. But three pounds don't make that big of a difference. Uh, I'm Dylan Love. You know, I'm not a perfect planner. Uh, I'm disappointed with my performance. But I showed that I was, that I was a, you know, a true champion. And that, um... I'm sorry, bro. My son's face looks crazy, son. Like, his face is swollen. They say his jaw is broke. Let me see by the way he's talking. I can fight with, after being knocked down and being hurt. You knew... Bro, he, he does look like his shit is, is fucked up back there. Like, pause. It looked like this shit is fucked up. <clears throat> Tough, bro. Tough L. Look at my son in the back. He's like, yo, it's going to be a long ride to the airport. I'm on the wrong side of the camp. But, hey, man, comment below, bro. Like, what you think about the fight? That was crazy. I'm I'm still in awe. Now I mean? Like, me and my bros are still talking about it. Like, yo, I can't believe it. But, yo, if you have money up, I'm glad I ain't put my money up because I would have lost all my chones. I was ready to put, like, big money up. I ain't going to lie. I just knew this was a definite dub for Devin. But Ryan put on a show. Congratulations. I want to see what you're going to do next. Now, I mean, hey, man, call me a bandwagon dude. I don't care. Like, you know what I mean, I've liked Ryan for the longest. Like, even when he fought, um, what's his name? Um, Javante, I wanted him to win. But after these... Crackhead antics he's been doing in the last month or two. I was like, nah, he he yeah, he's he's out of here. You know what I mean? But Ryan Garcia, you pulled the fan back in, bro. I want to see what you're gonna do next. Hey man, it's been your boy Ty Boogie. Until the next video. I think we're gonna do a reaction to Chris Brown and his little situation. I'm out of here, man. Peace.